Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play The Way. I'm your host, Dark Six. And we are about to go to the Lost City and go deep, deep below, below into the depths and find the truth, man. We're gonna find the truth if it kills us. We're gonna get the goddamn truth. Can I have, if Tom Cruise was here, he would just be shouting, You can't handle the truth! And I'd be like, yeah, probably not. That's what, Sacrifice wasn't the first guy to uh, try to build a huge, deep hole into the pits. Bring me down, unless, of course... No, cause this is... I don't, I, don't, I don't know what the deal is. The Lost City, Jan Wen, I, I, I can't... No idea. No fucking clue, honestly. Oh god, the mind puzzle. I hate this part. I do not like this mind puzzle. One fucking bit. It's boring and annoying and... Ugh, it's a mind... It's a mind... Cart puzzle! I don't like minecart puzzles, period, the end. Stop giving me so many heart stones. None of it matters. None of it matters! Well, hopefully, since I have the puzzle cheat on, I won't have to fucking do this. Let me just get all the chests. For what reason, I don't know, but I want them. Call me crazy. I don't care. I just want them. Land rock, nice. Put it on a plate, nice. Come here, you. Put you on a plate, nice. You know? And that ore is level 4, so I'm gonna change it, because... It doesn't know, but it's not leveling up anymore. That shit is on a plate. It's nice. Alright. Give me that. Thank you. Why is the other bland rock in a silver chest? What? What is? What is this? Racists. Anyway, I saw an hour earlier, so maybe it's just gonna let me skip the god of awful puzzle. This boring ass puzzle. Yes, it does. Thank fucking lord. You know, annoying that puzzle is. It's pretty annoying. I actually, I actually did the puzzle. <clears throat> When I played the game originally, you have to hit these switches and da 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 da. da. It's a real ball buster. This is a real ball buster. To say the least. Nothing, huh? Just an RT piece tile set with some Breath of Fire 2 bookcases? That's alright. Give me that grip. You give me that fat grip. Black hole. To black hole. It's racist. Pretty sure I have an obsession with saying this racist. So does the rest of the world, so it's all good. And I, I'm saying it in jest. It's, I'm satirical about it, I don't actually mean it. I think people don't know what the meaning of racist is, actually. I'm pretty sure they need to hit up that dictionary real quick. Most people have this strange, skewed vision that they don't know the difference between politically incorrect and racist. There is a big difference. You should figure that one out one day. Caves, houses, caves, houses, caves, houses. Fuck the way. Call it Caves and Houses. Episode 6. Okay, more- Episode 6, more caves and houses. And beds, too. Just in case you wanted to sleep in the cave or house, you can have a bed. How many of these fucking heartstones do I have, man? Shit, they're just piling them on. Well, apparently the last- the secret last boss is very hard. But I've never fought him. If I did, I wouldn't certainly fight him without the cheat on the battle off option, so... 
be kind of pointless for me to fight him. Get over here, you. Oh, my pattern's done. I'm a dumbass. He's like, hold on, wait. Remember before when he was talking about the flows? I never heard of something having so many flows. Hold on a sec. I want to see how many flows we have here. Flows. One, two, three. You could get more of these flows from those. You must have like a zillion flows by now. Get over here, you. you suck. That lady sure was nice to help us. We're gonna get to the bottom of this. This serious issue. Who the hell is that? Don't welcome me, asshole. I'll slap you upside the head. You look like an anti-paradan. We're adventurers. The Illuminati. They exist. I have one on my back. It's been tainted, however, and it's become a shadow sword. See? But then... All but one. We'll find out where that one is after, um, after the dream is over. <laughs> There, in the fiery depths of the reaches, they faced off against the evil one. Surely they fought most gallantly in victory. Must have been certain they scarred the evil one badly. The Lord Below was driven back. He conjured up a great power from the multitude to sway. And that desperate hour, he unleashed a shockwave that decimated the cars of all living things. The Illuminati vanished. Jan Wen burned. Kavakura. Are you certain of these things? Indeed. Anyway, the real story goes, the Illuminati are now the Shadow Swords. The last Illuminati is, is uh, if you haven't figured it out by now, Gaius has it. <clears throat> Gaius wields the last pure Illuminati, which is why Rue cannot hit him with a Shadow Sword, because they're like magnets. They can't, you know, Shadow Sword can't hit him. So that's just, it's just that simple. It tries to make it more complicated than it really is. Always worth a look. Hooray! Let me up there. I wanna know what's up here. Somebody stole my crayons and I think it was you, Morpheus. I did not steal your crayons. So yeah, this game's got an interesting story, to say the least. It's one of my favorite stories in a game, ever. Jesus, I have so many things. I'm not gonna fucking get half of this sh half this shit, probably.
Come on, man, absorb that bland rock. Think I'm fucking around? I'm not fucking around. Come on, come here. Come here, little boy, come on! Where you going? Yes, son. Oh, goodness. We got page three shit again. Let's get rid of it. Before it upsets me greatly. What could be down these steps? Who minds all this? I mean, seriously, you know how long it must have taken to make these pits? I mean, these tunnels? Holy shit. Must have taken them fucking decades. I mean, centuries even. Look at this. It's insane. I mean, these guys don't have power drills or shit like that, or... They probably had a stick, and, and, and that is it, and some rocks, and that's all they had to break down this shit, man. There's no electricity in this universe. They need a Ben Franklin to fix that, man. This is the first time Rue's been down into hell, so... Crider shell! That can't be good, the volcanoes are erupting. Oh, it's a boss. Let's change my pattern. Let's do a Toma. Just wanna, just wanna clear the screen, get all those things that I have one of. God, so annoying. This looks familiar. Wait, no it doesn't. Fire! No? Okay. I thought maybe I could light that torch. That torch. The fuck? Okay. Well, there we did that. It's obviously a looping animation, but... Oh, it's probably a parallel process of some sort. You guys that don't even know what I'm talking about most likely. RPG Maker terms. Okay, well then, at least you can see two endings. Here we go. Uh, let's do the normal ending first, right? And then we'll do the... Then we'll do the weird one. Assuming the game just lets me kill the last boss. Ah, the, the alternate ending's really depressing, apparently. Let's save. So now I have a data we can load up. Data 8. Let's go see the normal ending first, real quick. We've done it! This must be the tower's basement. We're gonna go get the truth. Ah, I don't remember episode 6 being this short. Maybe it's because I skipped getting Lexus and other characters. And I didn't do the arena. There's an arena thing you could do. You could actually fight uh, Kava there. Or he's called Kavax, but it's already assumed. I think it's proven that it's the Kava from Kura and Kava. Which, if you didn't know, at some point... I don't know if it was his original personality, but Rue was Kura. That's why I was saying that at the play. He actually is. I mean, he was at one point. And Rue actually did kill Kava. And then... Kura became Kava. See what I'm saying? Follow me. Follow me. Rue's been around for a long time. Yeah, seriously. Mixed. You got mixed feelings. You feel strange. Yeah, I don't know why everybody wants to go to the top of the tower. I know, I, I mean, 
I don't even know why Rue wants to get to the top of the tower. <laughs> Here we are again, climbing up the top of this tower. We did it once for Setsa. Is it locked? Certain people can pass. I could do it. I'm Rue. I got more orders than I know what to do with. We'll see. It's my destiny to unlock this door. Oh no, I need someone to unlock it. <laughs> I don't think so. I can do it. I know who could open that door. I forgot she's actually in this part. Oh no! I knew it was too soon to be over. How do you kill someone in a fake world? Is that like dying in the Matrix? I need to get another stupid teleport rock. Ah, another stupid stone. Just let me through the damn thing and stop adding more crap. Yeah. Yeah, I did. Do you have the stone? Let's go, let's go, let's go. Quick, 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 fast and in a hurry. Let's open up this portal. I'm gonna be in weird ass fairyland. Hmm. Intruders in the garden. What, you want some of this? Come on, come and get it, son. I'm just gotta make sure not to go over file 8. Get him, he said. I'm gonna assume that's what he said. His companions leveled up. Ooh, someone got feel good. Someone feels good. Out of my way, suckers. Nice. Now shit's just getting really fucking weird. Hey, does someone look familiar? It's Lyra. At least her afterlife's a happy one. She's got a little story. She gets a little story wish. But a dark cloak. I just killed a whole bunch of your knights. Oh well. 
That's Lyra. <laughs> she knows it too, because she looked all surprised when Rue called her Lyra. We're gonna have to have a chat with her. Couldn't afford a kingdom, so you just got a big ass house. Rue, always the curious one. Always changing. <laughs> he doesn't care about stuff, then he gives a shit about something. There's something on the table. Looks like a Nova Stone. Go back for it. <laughs> Wait a minute. Because she's pulling a moral on everybody. Damn straight I do, and I stabbed you, don't forget about that. <laughs> you better stop getting all fussy with me. What's this? You're crazy, lady. You fucking liar. Tell me. Oh, Jesus. His name, Lord Landorzen. Kind of sounds like Lander and Landorzan. That name's got to mean something. I hate to even speak it. Where's he at? In the north. To the stormy skies overlooking the poisonous marshes of Palinbor. Where are we? Black sludgy depths. No, I won't. I don't think so. <laughs> no. And I fucking ran a sword through you. I doubt it, you were fucking strata. That's right, so am I. Okay, fine, I made it up. Yeah, it is. Seriously, this place sucks. Nothing. Why do you ask? She hears a voice from the tower. Called out to me. Wanted me to enter. And you did you? Way years ago. No, that's impossible. Time here is skewed. Might be the one. You better go there. We need to get in there. You know what's there. I know what's there too. You don't. Unless you played it already. The truth. Yep, the truth is in there. Nobody wants to deal with that shit.
because she's a liar too. The truth. The truth hides nothing! Let me tell you a story about when I ran a sword through you. I wonder why nobody remembers when Rue kills them. <laughs> Need to focus on the tower. You know what you count on there. Yes, naturally. Like he says naturally, yeah, because you've done such a good job of that in the past. Let's see, you left her in a tent. You stabbed her. You almost killed her the first time you met. And I think I want to save before I do this at all, don't I? Like, can I save? I mean... Or is this just going to be a super long-ass episode? No, I don't think so. Hold up. Let's go to Jopeka's lab. Find a save point real quick. There we go. Alright, you guys. I'm gonna save for the next episode the me totally beating the game. Uh, or you guys. I mean, I don't feel like I'm beating a game. I feel like I'm just playing out in the story here because I'm skipping all the combat and stuff. So. You'll see the end of the story. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. And uh, video is seven days a week. So there'll be plenty more where this came from. Thank you. And I'll see you next time.